Now this mansion was built in the late 1800s. The guy ended up going bankrupt, couldn't afford it anymore, and he got evicted. So just think about that. The four children, this huge mansion for themselves. Think about how they were just everyday lives, just living in this place, and now they're completely gone. All their stuff is just left here, and we're seeing it. I know, dude, the kitchen is beautiful. Nothing gets more creepier than seeing old abandoned dolls. Holy f Hey, what's up everyone? Right now we're inside an abandoned mansion. Now this mansion was built in the late 1800s. The guy ended up going bankrupt, couldn't afford it anymore, and he got evicted. Now already looking at my view that you guys will be seeing soon, I'm already seeing an abandoned piano. I'm seeing all the furniture <laughs> still here, and it's very sad to hear that. Now, if you're noticing the quality is really great, it's because I'm filming in 4K resolution. This is my second video that I'm filming in 4K resolution and at 30 frame rates per second. Let me know at the end with a comment saying if you guys prefer 30 frame rate videos by 4K or the same old 1080p by 60 frame rate videos. Let's go. So this is how we walked in. We literally just walked in. That's all we had to do. The whole place is falling apart, but the upstairs looks fine. Someone must have kicked in here. It did some damage. I don't know. I don't know. We're in the basement right now, though. So we're going to go explore here and work our way up to the top. All their items are still left here, as far as I know. So it's going to be an amazing, amazing exploring. All right, making a way in. Wow. All their stuff is left here. And then they're all, they're all desks. I apologize if you guys can't hear me. I'm sorry, but I'm wearing my respirator. It's a lot of asbestos in here. Damn. Look at their couches and a lot of black mold as well here. I mean, this is amazing though. I'm assuming that they, the, the family must have kids as well. Bathroom. Can you believe this though? That they just left this here? They couldn't pay their mortgage and this is what happens? They already got destroyed. They should just let them keep it. That's how America works. A lot of items here. You know, they have a lot of paint here. They must have been redoing it at one point. But then the vandals came and destroyed it. Really just bringing down the, the cost, the total cost of the house, where it wasn't even sellable. It's not even worth fixing anymore. It's just worth knocking down. That's all it is now. I'm not sure what that is. But then again, there must have been a paintball gun here as well. And a BB gun. Look at that. Can you believe that? There's a paintball gun right here. Bunch of all, all their items are just left here. Now that's interesting. A drawing of an old clown. His face is all smudged in. And there's the owner right there. I'm not going to completely show his face. That was the owner's house right there. You can't really see, but that was his wife as well. It looks it appears to be their wedding pictures. This room has all these skis left here. And look at that. Can you believe that? Just left. People don't couldn't take their stuff when they moved out or when they got kicked out or evicted. It is kind of crazy how there is a sharp knife just left there, though. There's a sharp knife laying there. There could be a killer here. There is. Uh oh, Steve's the killer. Steve's the killer. The basement's pretty big. Hmm. Their old fish tank. I think this is the first abandoned place I've been in that all their stuff was left here. Surprise. Nothing gets more creepier than seeing old abandoned dolls. Holy f***. F*** that. Damn, look at their own tool shop. 
Vandals must have came here and stole all the tools out, that's for sure. Tools are worth a lot of money. No doubt people have came and took that. Anything that was valuable here is definitely gone. And this is what's left. But this, like I said, this place is still recently, I think, new. All this stuff is just around. Is that a compressor? This is, this is the movie saw right here. We gotta saw off our legs. <laughs> it says bodies with a nice, nice tag. Damn. Damn now cool. that is old. I actually like how it looks. I think it's a class picture of college. It definitely looks like you're in college right here, like a college old picture. Yeah, it looks like Harvard or something. It's gotta be. They look so preppy. They really look preppy, it's amazing. It's like a Harvard picture. Yep. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go upstairs if you guys wanna join me. Dun dun dun. Shall we? Let's go. Alright, let's see what's up here. Now everything's left here. Look at it. even their bicycle helmets. I mean, even their helmets are here. I mean, this place is just all here. Their, their, their knee pads and elbow pads. I wonder how many children live in here. How many children did the guy have? Oh my fing god. Is that a grand piano? Holy shit. This place is amazing. This is one of the best mansions I've ever went into. Look at this. This is a rare find. This is like um, you're in England right now type of place. Wow. The marble bathrooms, the marble floors. I love this place a lot. Wow, all their books are here. This was their office or library. Yep, this was definitely one of his offices. Look at this. Fax machines, phones, fireplace, waffles, tons of books, a hat. This place is amazing. Look at that lift. That fan is nice. Oh, look at the bed frame. This must have been someone's room. A lot of... A lot of tags up here and paint splatters, which really f***s it up, but still a very amazing place. Aliens are among us. I'm so impressed with this location. Now what's the best thing about this, I never thought I would ever find a grand piano here. These things are at least starting off at like five, six thousand dollars, could even be more. And it sucks that these kids or people just threw paint on it. But dude, let me let me see this real quick. The flower's still here. Look at this. All just left here. Does it work? Wow. Still works. And those kids are and those mother I can't believe they actually spray paint that. Who the hell would spray paint a grand piano like that? It's like complete disrespectful for sure. Those bastards. So nice though. I'm not going to show their faces just for the sake of the property owners, but their family picture is right here on the fireplace in the main hall. Can you imagine that? Having to lose your place or something happened? It's, it's, it's so sad. But this is, this is amazing history. Just think about it. So just think about that. This was a four, they had four children. This huge mansion for themselves. Think about how they were just everyday lives just living in this place and now they're completely gone. All their stuff is just left here and we're seeing it. And that's just, it makes you think, all your mind gets curious and you just wonder like what were their names or what they used to do here and, and you're walking through old history right now and it's just unbelievable. It's amazing. in here. 
Got some caution tape, cleaning supplies, bolt cutters, garden cutters, all their items. A big b their Mitch kitchen, their microwave. It's in their fridge. Well, they actually still had stuff left in their fridge. Oh, it smells so fing bad. <coughs> oh, God damn, well, I feel like throwing up. Oh my God. You do? No, I'm saying that you fing Are you scared of me? I thought you said you heard someone. I was gonna say, I hear someone, um. <laughs> Some stuff. Oh, dude, yeah, it smells so bad. I know, dude, the kitchen is beautiful. This is awesome. And this is just all left here. I can't get over it. Can you imagine just abandoning your house like this? This is such a cool kitchen. Definitely an amazing kitchen. Like you're not taking me out of here. For real. Have you seen my kitchen? <laughs> you're like, oh, yeah, you know that. Look at this, it goes further. Tons of stuff. Oh, they would yeah they would it's save the they would save all their bags like that's what my family does we save all our bags for our food. Oh, uh, it's the bag drawer. Everyone's yeah. got a bag drawer. Everyone does have a There's bag. Drawer. Like that. This is the pantry. Yep. They got a beer they machine. Had, they had cheese balls they there. Made beer. Oh, they Corn. made their own beer. Maybe. Beer machine. Maybe. <laughs> and whatever it is, it looks cool. Yeah, yeah. I'm just a little upset. You know why? Because all the. All the people who came in before us just destroyed the place. They could have kept it somewhat the way it was. Instead of just throwing everything all over the place, taking all the valuables. Wow. Tons of boxes. You know who would love this place? Dan Bell. Yeah. Dan Bell would love to be here. Look at this. I have to go upstairs soon. This is so old. That is very old. So this looks like their living room. One of their living rooms actually. Nice portrait up there. Curtains are pretty cool. And look at that, they even have their, um, I don't know what those are called, not couch, but whatever, it's just, Intact left there. One of the many fireplaces. Hey, look at that. They're old shoes. Damn. Oh, the wood's still there. So we just did the left side of the place. They must have went skiing a lot. Now we're going to go over there. So just when I thought, I haven't even been in their backyard yet. Look at that. Their, seat, their little um, horses, their kid horses right there, and then look at how big that pool is. We're gonna have to check out the backyard after we're done the inside. So I decided to be the first one to go upstairs and check it all out. You guys stay down there. I'm gonna man it up and go upstairs. Dude, I feel like I'm honestly though in Wonderland. Like, like you're in your own world now. Like I'm completely just, out of reality and I, and I just think like this is it, you're just in your own fantasy world and that's how I feel every time I go inside abandoned places. But this one is completely gives me a different feeling. Like, I don't know, it's just really like it's way more realer than other places because this is an actual family's house and I don't know. There's, everything is just thrown into the middle though. All their items just thrown right into the middle of the place. And damn, there's even another floor after this I didn't even know about. I thought there was just two floors. Look at this. Goes up again. So we're gonna have to check that out. The world is ours. Alright. See all their stuff is just jot just thrown in the middle of here as well. But if I'm not mistaken, this should be where their bedrooms are and stuff. Let's go. Oh my god. Goes that far down? Holy shit. There is so much stuff here. There... It looks like a teenager's room, but I'm not sure. It looks like a fabric room as well, like they would sew or something. Satan just on the walls. Yeah, yeah, see, that this was their sew room, so they must have made a whole bunch of stuff here. Maybe they had a business going on with sewing or making making um, dresses or something. 
some fashion stuff. I'm gonna go down this hallway now. See what's going on. So that's the way up. Like I said, I gotta, I gotta clear this floor first before I move up. I do that before. I've always cleared all my floors one by one before just hopping up to a new floor because I always get confused and lost. TV's just smashed up. Once again, everything's left in the middle. Help me, SOS. You're ugly. You're BAMP ugly. Wow. Look at this. F*** here. God damn. The whole place is crazy. I've never been to a place where they're like actually... Damn, you scared me with your flashlight, homie. Homie G. <laughs> what else is here? Closet. What's in this one? Some bathtubs. And... Nice. All right, I ended up back here. So we're we'll going inside this one now. Looks like to be another bedroom. Must have been for the one of the girls. I mean, I know they had guest rooms as well. Oh man, the chair's just in the corner. Oh wow. Dude, that is awesome, a mini slot machine. It's broken, but whatever. That's your outside view. Got the nice pillars over there. Hmm. Pinocchio book. Oh, this one looks nice. I like the dark, I, do, I love dark colored rooms. My favorite. Damn, they had True Crime Streets of LA. I love that game. Got Lord of the Rings game. This door is blocking my path. Let's move it. All right. <laughs> wow. I think this is my favorite room so far. Can't believe they have the punching bag here. God, oh God damn. This is just completely open onto the roof. We will not be going up there until we're done the whole place. Exploring. Let's move on, shall? Well, this floor's done, but I did miss a little bit over there. All right. Let's go check out up here where Cody is. Hell is here. Okay. It does look creepy and small. Let's go. Oh my God. Every floor gets better. No fucking way. A pool table here as well? Dude, anything could be here, man. I can't believe they just abandoned everything. This is their gym. The whole workout and everything. Man, these kids and people had it made, huh? It's so sad how they had to leave or something happened. Alright, so Cody said come here. Alright, I'm coming. Dude, can it be more amazing than already? Oh my god, look at the lighting. This whole place is a freaking maze. We are the future. It's back here in the deep, deep. Oh my god. Alright, let's go. Oh, another bathroom. Look at this. Not that, this. What is this? It's an old computer. Panasonic business partner. I tried turning it on. It doesn't it doesn't work. It's out of battery, I'm guessing. What? Yeah, look at this thing. It's like one of those old Apple computers. Oh, okay, okay, dude, that is really old. Except it's not that old. I looked it up. It's not that old? Yeah. But it's not like Apple old, like it's not worth a ton of money. Okay, okay. And look at that though, they're bike helmet too. That's yeah. a... They're biking and computing at the same time. Seriously. 
Whoa. This would be my room if I lived here with the open um, window type thing. Yeah, it's awesome. Find what you love. I love these quotes on here. Yeah, I was going to say, there's like all yeah. these motivational quotes and it's like, kill yourself. Yeah. <laughs> Find what you love, but kill yourself. Seriously. There's other people making this. must have been a person came with the motivation quotes, then a person with the kill yourself quotes. Yeah. yeah hey, hey, Spongebob is in there. Let's go check out Spongebob. There's a camo. Must have been from Morocco. <laughs> and then there's the alien people again. Dude. Paint. I do smell paint, actually. This is a sign you have to go to Morocco. Yeah, for real. Here. I'm coming with you, man. Oh, almost tripped. Oh, wait, it's not. What is it? It goes to the top of the roof. All right, let's go up. Dude, that is straight up, man. We're on the roof. Oh, oh. What? What? You can walk out here. You can. It's a. It's a walk-in roof. Yeah. I'm coming up. Oh my god, dude! It's. Uh, I gotta hold my hands up. Cause it's so high. Don't want to be seen. Oh my god. Be seen. You're in a very urban neighborhood. Oh, we're on top of the roof. Look at that. You said they had Christmas lights up here. Wow, people must have been hanging over here. Hey, there's another coin, love life. What's up, man? This is awesome, I wish I could afford this for my house. A walk-in roof. And we're gonna go back down now. Look how straight down it is. God damn. Right banging my head. Okay. Well, that was awesome. Good to be back in here though. What is this? Like a crawl space. Oh hell no. I ain't going in there. Nice bed. Take my girl. Lick me. Look at that, I had a furnace. Port uh, it looks like we had those portable furnaces. Look at a lot of money. More bathrooms. Anything in their closet? What? Look at a secret door closet. Oh my god. So it's like hidden. Look at that, I just went from from here. It's a crawl space. Look at that, out the window, back into the house. That's awesome. All right, so I see in the movie sometimes that if you look at the carpet, there's some crazy like like rituals or carvings on the floors and under the carpet. So we're gonna go ahead and look at the carpet and see if we see anything under here. Let me move this real quick. I, don't know, I swear to God, this place is so crazy. Like I feel like there is like hidden rooms in here we don't know about. But we'll find out. I don't see anything. Nope. Oh well. It was worth a shot. <laughs> Just found something on the floor over here. Caution, biohazard. I wonder what happened. Makes me think now. Oh, the one that says climb? Oh, I saw stairs stairs. Yeah, it's, it leads them to the walking roof, but we went up there really quick. All right, so I think we covered the whole entire mansion, but just to make sure, we're gonna start back from the second floor and work our way back up, see if we missed anything, like a hallway or something. Okay, sit down there and see if I missed anything. It is creepy though. Hell is here. That is correct. I know. All right. Yeah. So we walked in here already. That is for sure. The only place I might have maybe missed in this whole mansion would be down this hallway. <coughs> and Steve is coughing a lot because he's sick. In case you guys are wondering why you hear coughing all the time. I was up there. Been there. And I definitely been here. Alright, no, I did it. And again, what is this? It's locked. It's a locked door. I can't get in. Dude, I was looking at this place. It's like... Why is there a bunch of drawers and then there's like a stove right here? There is a bunch of drawers. What is like, in here? It's so tiring organizing all of their clothes that they have to eat real quick. 
For real, I think I'm gonna find something spooky in here. A tr it's a drawer with another drawer. Dude, is this Inception? It doesn't open. This must be the timeout room. Yeah, you think so? Yeah, it's hard to, the kids get in trouble. Have to, like, do... It's a drawer within a drawer. <laughs> <laughs> That's so weird. See, people get lazy and they don't open up their stuff. We might, we might like open up a drawer and find like some gold. Go yeah, gold. Gold bars. Gold bars just left in here. In the laundry. They all look empty. Yeah, no, it could have been some kind of crazy shit going on here. One or burning candles. One of these could have gold bars. Gold bars could be inside these drawers. So we gotta play like Fallout and check them all. Yeah, for real, Fallout. I like this, um, the design on the actual floor though. The yeah. hardwood floor. All right, everyone, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, for us, it was all different. We've never been inside of a location yet that had this much stuff all left here, especially yeah. it's very all personal items. Yeah. Just, yeah, it's, it's, it's crazy, all right? Especially it's a family house, all left here. We've never been inside one. This is our first one for sure. And it's probably not our last. Hopefully. Hopefully, yeah, you're right. And like I said, this is my first, this is actually my second 4K video shot. Maybe if it's good enough, I'll film more. Let me guys know if you guys like the 4K videos or should I just kept going 60 frames by 1080p. Let me know on that. We got Cody. Got to follow him. Links below. And follow Exploring with Steve as well. His link's below. Follow me as well. Duh. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And until next time.